Good morning. I would like to ask you to comment on Czech presidential election outcome. And I have a second related question. Andrei Babiš recently said that he would like to attend the European Council meetings uh, instead of Prime Minister Petr Fiala in case he is to become Czech president. Could you comment on this idea? Do you think that it would be a good move for the Czech Republic? Thank you. Well, nobody is waiting on European level for Babiš. Huh? Nobody. Nobody really is waiting. Uh, he is uh, even having now the outcome of the court case in mind, but he is still seen as a person who has some problems to make a distinction between his business interests and the state interests. That's, I think, obvious. He is uh, uh, an ally of uh, Viktor Orban, if I may say so. Putin friend, Viktor Orban. Uh, that is also what we perceive. And that's why let me also say that I was quite surprised that Emmanuel Macron, the president of France, was welcoming Babish as a campaigner a few days before the presidential elections took place. So I think also Renew has to consider is this really the right partner we have there in the Czech Republic. Um, so again, nobody is waiting for Babish. I, I'm happy that uh, 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 the second candidate, Pavel, uh, did a great job. He arrived as number one and he has a good chance to win uh, in the second round. Um, he is a strong leader. He knows the European level. He was based in the NATO. He's experienced and respected uh, in this regard. I also think it is uh, in the Czech tradition a good thing to have an independent person elected as president of the country. So I and uh, my friends are supporting the candidate uh, Pavel for, for, for his, uh, for his, uh, for his uh, uh, election in the second round. So again, I hope that this will be the outcome. And the second thing you said about the question of uh, representation in the council, it's a poorly uh, national, uh, also uh, uh, constitutional question for Czech Republic, so it's nothing where we have to comment.